What is going on, all you wonderful people of YouTube? It's your boy Ryan here with Motown Madness. I'm going to be bringing you something a little cool here. Um, it's going to be some 1990 score Series 2 packs and then uh, two Series 1 packs. One of my buddies went to a local card show up in the Sacramento area. He also picked me up this limited edition Super Bowl 25 Silver Anniversary Commemorative set. Looks like it comes with 160 Super Bowl cards. Um, I've never seen these. I don't know. Like, personally, I've never opened them. So I'm going to open these all up. And uh, I thought it was really cool that my buddy thought of me and sent these over my way. And, you know, they were pretty cheap. So might as well take a look at them and, and see what comes in them. I don't know if there's really anything that's too much of value. But I've never really opened much old school stuff. So it's interesting to feel the difference uh, in the packaging material with that old school. That's cool. Let's see. Carter, Frank Reich, 49ers guy. Wow, I don't even know. McIntyre, Larry Roberts. Pretty cool to see some old school stuff. I've never opened up any packs of these. There's a Mike, Mike Singletary. Um, it's pretty cool. Oh, there you go. Joe Montana. I like that. These look really cool. Um, so I don't know if there's really anything of value in here. I just know this was the year, I believe, uh, the Giants played against, who was it? The Bills, I think. And that's when the Giants won, right? So I'm going to kind of go through these and just see what they look. I appreciate you joining me. Let's see Kevin Mack. Is there any old school collectors out there? Um, let me know if there's any. Oh, Lawrence Taylor. I recognize some of these names. Let me know if there's any uh, really cool cards that you're supposed to be chasing after in these sets. Because, I don't know, but it's cool to be able to build a collection of my 49ers and get some of the old school players. That's nice. Okay, cool. Dang, there's been a lot of 49ers. I wonder, is that because the uh, Niner guy on the, on the front of it? <laughs> Let's see, these ones are now the last of the Series 2. So is there a difference between the look of the Series 1 Series 2? I'd imagine so. That's pretty cool. But yeah, these were only like little $1 packs at the local card show up there in Sacramento. So it was really cool to be able to have my buddy bring those back for me. Shout out to you, Josh. Appreciate that, my dude. Bring you guys a little more content. I know this isn't any uh, top of the line product, but that's really cool. Little throwbacks. I haven't opened much classic stuff. So nice to see just kind of the older designs there. I've been recently going after buying some singles of 1990s and 2000s tops finest and bowman's chrome so it's kind of cool to get the uh the throwback looks so a little damage there on the card that's right let's see Ooh, what's that little mini card oh it's a little super bowl trivia card let's see if it shows up Did it pop up anything that's pretty neat let's see if it actually goes through on the camera I'm not sure if that's worth anything, but I'm, I'm, I'm going to toss that into a little penny sleeve just to just to be safe. That's rad. Look at that, man. That is cool. They were really unique back then, huh? I like that. That's awesome. I've never pulled a mini card. I uh, totally forgot those were even a thing, to be honest with you. That is sweet, dude. Warren Moon. Barry Sanders. Oh, a little lightning there in the background. That's awesome. Hot gun. I like that. That was really cool. So is that kind of something like uh, what the inserts used to be, I wonder? You know how nowadays we have a million inserts of every single card. That's kind of like a little insert, a little mini one. I'm going to have to look that, that bad boy up. Troy Aikman. Oh, see, there's no... Oh, you know what? Maybe... Uh, I, I see, I see. Maybe it just came with the uh, the different score versions. It's a little trivia. Let's see what's it say. Who had the longest run with a recovered fumble in Super Bowl history? Mike Bass, Randy Hughes, J Jake Scott, or Mike Hegman? Uh, well, you flip it upside down. Answer was A, Bass ran 49 yards for a touchdown. Recovered the fumble. Let's check the other one. Who holds the record for the longest kickoff return in Super Bowl history? Rick Upchurch, Fulton Walker, Larry Anderson, or Billy Camfield? Uh, pause the video if you don't know the answer, or if you do want to guess the answer. But uh, read it off. It's answer B. Walker returned a kickoff 98 yards for a touchdown. Those are really cool. I like those little trivia cards. So not sure if those hold any real financial value, but that's just really cool. 
It's kind of for the personal collection. A little talking piece. Well, shout out, Josh. I appreciate that, dude. Those are those are awesome. I'm gonna open up just this uh, silver commemorative pack. Ooh. So I don't know. Is this just like a complete set? It doesn't seem like there's any, you know, random inserted cards or whatever. But I'll fix that a little bit. Oh boy. Let's see if I can get this open without totally damaging it. How do you? Oh, okay. Does it kind of slide out? I gotcha. Oh, nice. Let's see if I can do this without totally destroying all of them. Nice. That is cool. I'll just kind of go through them really quick. I don't think we need to oops, set those off to the side until the very end. Just to kind of get the look of all these old school ones. Whoa, those are cool, dude. So it's got all these tickets. Tunnel 3, row 26. Nice, so that's kind of like uh, ticket seats, huh? Those are cool, man. The artwork on those are awesome. Oh, that's cool. So it looks like you got a bunch of tickets. Oh, man. Feel free to slow down the video or pause it if you see any cards that you think look really cool. I didn't even know all this exists. I mean, obviously, I know there's all these older cards, but those are pretty sweet. Tom Flores, Joe Gibbs, Tom Landry. So you get all the coaches' pictures. That's something you don't get a, a whole lot in a lot of these packages that you open up. Terry Bradshaw. Oh, there we go. Joe Montana. <laughs> Obviously, I know I pronounced that wrong, but Joe Montana, he's great. That's cool. Collect some of these old school ones. Roger Craig. Nice. That's going into the PC for sure. Add to the 49ers. If you guys know any really cool products that has some cool older inserts, like I said, I've been going after uh, some of the 1990s, the Topps Finest, Bowman Chrome. Just kind of, there we go. That's awesome. Those are going to be cool for the PC. Um, I'm looking for kind of inserts that aren't crazy expensive. You know, you go after a lot of these new rookies, brand new products, and holy macaroni, it gets expensive quick. So if you know of any cool old sets, just stuff like this, you know, where it's value, cool looking cards, Randy Cross, Larry Little. Feel free, put that down in the comment section. What's your favorite product that you've ever opened, whether it's hobby, retail, old school, classic cards, or uh, the newer ones? What sort of sets are your favorite? Feel free, let me know down there. And, uh, also, as always, please like and subscribe. Give me those comments. I want to interact with you guys. I kind of want to see what products you guys would love to see, what sort of stuff you want me opening. Do you enjoy some of this old school stuff? Do you enjoy newer boxes, hobby boxes? Speaking of, I've actually got a, something pretty big, in my opinion. I've got this brand new 2022 Prism. It's a complete set. On the exclusive Pandora cardstock, number two, 400. So, looks like the cards are numbered to 400. And I got a guaranteed Black Star Prism, number two, one. So, let me know what do you guys think. Should I open this? Should I keep it for a collector's piece? Or, you know, let me know. What do you think I should do? Comment on that. Tell me. Let's see what else we've got. Go through the rest of these. Singletary, Carl Banks. These are cool, dude. A lot of cool old action shots. Yeah, I'm not sure how much value there is in all these ones, but definitely might they they look real clean, look real crisp, good corners. Ooh, there we go, Ronnie Lot. Might have to send some of these out for for grading. Uh, send them to HGA. They've got a fourteen dollars special right now, just kind of for the personal collection. I know they don't have crazy resale value like uh, PSA does or anything like that, but hey, I'm trying. To Sorry for the lighting there. I gotta gotta adjust that a little bit. Maybe put these further down. Huh? That's cool. Got those tickets, ticket cards. Nice. Ray Wershing, huh? Gonna be going back. I definitely don't recognize all these. Flip that over. Johnny Unitas. Well, there you go. That's cool. <clears throat> Network Super Bowl moment. Okay. Oh, nice. They've even got the, the Jets flying over. So these look like they're all moments cards. 
Jim Brownfield will kind of set these off to the side. Howard makes only NFL catch. Nice. That's cool. I remember hearing a... Oh, oh, this is pro set. This isn't score necessarily. Oh, nice. That is cool. Buns prevents touchdown. That's awesome. Um, I remember hearing there was a lot of... These older products had some really cool action shots. I like these. Just kind of unique stuff. Special offer from Pro Set. Game program. Nice. Those are cool. I like the artwork on these too. Kind of like a classic throwback look to them. Nice. Nice. But yeah, that's great. That's worth it. It was only what, like 10 bucks? But that is cool. I love the artwork on those. Really cool to look at. Redskins. Sorry, Washington football team, Washington commanders, whatever you want to call them nowadays. <laughs> Nice, those are sweet. I'm gonna kind of do a little recap here. I really loved this little mini trivia. That's pretty cool. And then got some more 49ers from my collection. Awesome. Well, Josh, I appreciate that, man. Thank you for thinking of me. And please feel free, guys, like, subscribe, use my card shells link if you guys need some protection from your collection. Sorry, for your collection, if I could talk right. And you take it easy out there. I'll see you on the next one. Mm -hmm.